I tell you, Nicole, what they say, because I met this one thing, man. I know only one thing. I never met me an angry pot smoker. I never met a man who's going, hey, you fucking prick! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> because you see, marijuana. <laughs> I know this one. Wait a <laughs> Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh. Okay. If you smoke a lot of pot, you may never become a rocket scientist. Or maybe. <laughs> if you've seen some of the things that have happened recently with NASA, maybe you can. <laughs> Okay, uh, okay, okay, here's the fun. Oh, fuck, okay. Okay, the Mars lander, okay? <laughs> I did the calculations in feet, <laughs> but I programmed the lander in meters. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> so instead of landing, fucker buried. <laughs> $185 million, whoopsie. <laughs> Two years flat. <laughs> oh, okay, fuck, here's a better one. Okay, The Hubble telescope. <laughs> I forgot to put in a lens. <laughs> Read the top line. Uh, Alpha Centauri, uh, Sirius, the rest is just a black hole. <laughs> I once called Stephen Hawking's house. Hello, this is Stephen Hawking. Yes, I'd like to leave a message. No, this is Stephen Hawking. <laughs> I know one thing, though. You know, Pot is not like alcohol. Alcohol changes your mood sometimes. Like, go to a bar at happy hour and see some just happy motherfuckers there. <laughs> see those guys going, hey, fuck you, my man. Hey, mm. hey, listen to me. <laughs> listen to me, you piece of shit. Mm. <laughs> listen, you do not know shit about fuck, my man. <laughs> you want a piece of yourself? Mm. Step outside, I'll kick my ass. Come on. I've already shit myself. I'm halfway there. Come on. Come on, you fucker. <coughs> and some people know you've got a, you can deal with it genetically. You know, if you're Irish, you've got a running start that you can do it better than we are. You know that because if you're Irish, you know, you'll kick my ass, but then you'll fucking sing about it afterwards. <laughs> oh, that night you said my wife was fat. I knocked you down and shit in your hat. Away the time we go, love it. Coming away for real. Moving a day, my lawyer. And then you keep drinking till you're in your 80s and you're on a dialysis machine doing liver dance and Michael Flatline. Beep. And they say the Irish saved civilization, drank a couple of Guinness and forgot where they fucking put it. But that's all right. Here's the drill. And the Japanese, they drink differently than us. It is a different thing where you can be very polite during the day and all of a sudden you, arigato with us. And after five Jack Daniels, <laughs> Tie a yellow river. <laughs> hey, for God! Karaoke for asshole with a microphone. Sing you round thy fuck, come on! <laughs> and if you want a linguistic adventure, go drinking with a Scotsman. Because you can't fucking understand them before. <laughs> you land in Scotland and they're going, Tilk, if you like. Right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, right, you dig it, eh? Fuck, can't you put fight burning the bullets at the scene, right? Can't put in your neck, mate? Sure. Oh, fuck, sure, right? Man, you know the fuck, my backside there, tweak your ass on the floor, right? Can't be, eh? Sure. Oh, sure, you dumb fucking bastard. You realise that, eh? And you realise how drunk they get, they could wear a skirt and not care. And how they could invent a sport like golf. Here's my idea for a fucking sport. I knock a ball in a gopher hole. Oh, you mean like pool? Fuck off, pool! Not with a straight stick, with a little fucked up stick. I whack the ball that goes in a gopher hole. Oh, you mean like croquet? Fuck croquet! 
I put the whole hundreds of yams away. <laughs> oh, fuck out of yam. It's great fun there. Oh, yeah, that's a great thing. Oh, like a bowling thing. Fuck no. <laughs> Not straight, I put shit in the way. <laughs> like trees and bushes and high glass. So you can lose your fucking ball and go whacking away with a fucking tire iron. Whacking away and each time you miss you feel like you're gonna have a stroke. <laughs> Fuck, that's what we'll call it. A stroke, because every time you miss you feel like you're gonna fucking die. <laughs> oh, great. Oh, here's a bit of fun. Oh, fuck, this is brilliant. Right near the end, I'll put a flat piece with a little flag to give you fucking hope. <laughs> but then I'll put a pool and a sandbox to fuck with your ball again. <laughs> ah, you'll be there trashing your ass, jerking away in the sand. <laughs> And you do this one time. Fuck no! <laughs> 18 fucking times! The manly sport of golf, where you can dress like a pimp and no one will care. <laughs> where you can wear clothes and even a blind gay man would go, oh dear Christ. <laughs> Those are loud. This is not carnival. What the fuck are you on? <laughs> even the alligator's going, asshole. <laughs> and you get in the, it's such an exciting athletic sport too. Whack the ball, get in the cart. <laughs> Whack the ball, get in the cart. <laughs> and the commentary's electrifying. Just this side of curling for really getting me going. Uh, we're on the third green now. Could people be quieter? I'd like to hear the grass grow. I want the guy who does Mexican soccer to do golf one time. The ball is running. The ball is going to the... those old waspy motherfuckers go, oh dear Christ. <laughs> My God, they're not gardening, they're playing now. Oh shit. What the hell are we gonna do? Because that was their last domain of dominance. It was their area. They were the king up until Tiger. Yes. Son of a black man and a Thai woman. Not even a German geneticist could have thought that one up. Black athletic ability, Buddhist concentration. Chitai! Chitai! Crouching putter! <laughs> and then he goes to the British Open and he plays at St. Andrews, where they fucking invented the sport. And after the fourth round, he's 18 under par, and there's only 18 fucking holes. <laughs> and all the old men are going, oh my God, we're doomed. How did he learn to play? We wouldn't let him join, dear God. <laughs> and they start having nightmares of golf carts going. Pff, 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 pff. <laughs> yo, 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 I'm playing through, whether you're a Gentile or a Jew. Pebble Beach, motherfucker. <laughs> Send it. Because all of your gentle sports are no longer gentle, tennis used to be, oh. Oh. Until the Williams sisters. Ah! 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 40 love? No, that's good love, baby. <laughs> yeah. And boxing, even boxing's changed. Remember boxing? People go, I go to boxing to watch the sport of boxing. Yeah, it's like saying, I go to stock car races to see people take left turns all day. <laughs> no, you go to boxing to see someone get the fuck beat up. <laughs> Even the guy who loses going, I have 18 million dollars. I don't know where it fucking is. I'm gonna buy me a big ass house, but I can't find it. <laughs> Fuck off. Until boxing was the same. And then Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson comes along and bites somebody. <laughs> Let's get ready to nibble. And all these guys go, oh, dear God, he bit somebody. I said, you're lucky he just bit somebody. Mike just got out of prison. You're lucky he didn't fuck him. Come on. <laughs> you bite somebody in jail, it's like, you're ready, bitch. You're mine now. Break it up. When I'm finished, 
Because Mike said to a journalist, I'm going to fuck you till you love me. 